Hey guys, welcome back or welcome to dinner and dessert. Today I thought I would show you guys my stuffed cabbage recipe. So for this recipe, you're going to need one pound of ground turkey. You're going to need a third a cup of tomato sauce and a quarter cup of ketchup. And I just mixed this together in the same bowl, but you could do it separately if you'd like. You're going to need some yellow onion. My onion was relatively small, so I just used all of it. But if you have a big onion, just use about half of it. And then you're going to need some cabbage leaves. So I boiled these in some water for about five to ten minutes. You don't want these to be really soggy, but you want to make sure that you can fold them in half without them breaking so that we can um, fold them up when we stuff them. We're also going to need some water. I just forgot to mention that in the ingredients. So the first thing I'm going to do is make the sauce. So I'm going to take some olive oil, spread that around in my pan, and just heat that up for about 30 seconds or so, or even a minute, just until it gets nice and hot. And then you can add in your onions and just saute that until the onions get really nice and golden brown. So once these are nice and golden brown, about two minutes or so, you can add in your water, mix that up, and then you can add in your tomato sauce and ketchup. Mix that together. And this is on about medium low heat and you're done with your sauce. So you can just set that aside. And then in a separate pan, I'm gonna put in some olive oil, let that heat up and I'm gonna add in my ground turkey. Now, once that is about halfway cooked, you can add in your rice. I'm just gonna cook this on about medium low heat for just two more minutes. It doesn't have to be fully cooked because it will finish cooking in the oven. So now we can start to assemble. So I'm gonna put some of my sauce at the bottom of my pan and then I'm gonna take my cabbage leaves and I'm just going to cut the very end off so that we can roll it. Now you can stuff these. So depending on what size they are, you wanna fill them about pretty much full. Um, I had pretty big ones, so I filled them uh, pretty big. Um, but if you have a small one, just put about three tablespoons in there depending on how much you like. Keep stuffing them, and then you wanna make sure to put some sauce on top, put these in the oven, and you're done. Guys, these are so delicious, so easy to bake, and I know they will be your new family favorite. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time on dinner and dessert. Bye.